Lucas Media. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. So we got breaking news. Coach Prime has been named Sports Illustrated Sports Person of the Year. And I'll put the article uh, and I'll pin it to the comment section. Yeah, Coach Prime has been named Sports Person of the Year. Now, they one of the reasons why they're saying it is due to it's been over a dozen regular season games that drew at least 8 million viewers. And Colorado was involved in three of them. And even their game was bigger than the Ohio State Notre Dame game as far as viewership. The article goes on to talk about the prime effect and just as far as like revenue going up, celebrities at the game, they sold out every game. And and also also the article talks about how Dion was the only person to ever play in the Super Bowl and the World Series, which also is a reason why a lot of people are rooting for Coach Prime. All right, so check it out. I personally am not surprised by any of this. Um, Coach Prime, he's been through a lot, right? They they loved him last year at Jackson State, but then they hated him when he left. But then they term everybody trying to start loving him again in Colorado, and now they hating him again. So he's been through a very up and down year as far as like people being on the bandwagon, off the bandwagon. But none, of, like I said, none of this surprises me. I mean, shout out to him. I do think he deserves it, honestly. Just even though they, even though they lost the last, I believe, seven out of eight games. What I will say is, they were the talk of the town, especially for the first three weeks. Right? You couldn't see anything without Coach Prime, and even Shador. Shador was a Heisman favorite at the beginning of the year, and nobody expected them to even be to even beat TCU and. Then they had that thriller against Colorado State. And I know they beat Nebraska. So they had some notable wins. And even with several games, they were they were pretty much down to the wire. They should have beat Stanford. It was up 29 to nothing. But they got a little too comfortable and they ended up getting beat. But uh, hats off. I mean, it makes sense. He literally resurged that program. Now, yes, Colorado's always had a... You know, a decent team here and there. And yes, y'all had that. They had a, they had a Heisman winning trophy winner back in the 90s. But as far as like the casual person knowing work about Colorado, that didn't exist. And while he's been losing recruits and he just lost his offensive coordinator to San Diego State, the sky is bright for Coach Prime. And he even said it basically that everybody needs to get ready. If you can't see it now, he don't he don't understand how. So this is let you know how real the prime effect was. It was it was big at Jackson State. It's big at Colorado. And while he still has a long road ahead, right as far as the transfer portal and recruiting, when you have stuff like this, this is things like this that let you know that he's moving in the right direction. But shout out to Coach Prime and Colorado Buffaloes. Tell me what y'all think about him winning this award.